Welcome down onto the tech desk and in today's video we're going to be looking at this. So this is an HDMI dongle that enhances 1080p to 4K resolution and we're going to test that. In this video we're going to split up into three parts. The first part will be just talking about this and how to set it up and we're going to go through the website as well to see what they claim for this dongle. The second part will be gameplay. So I've kind of gone through a load of gameplay and how I've captured it links down below if you want to go and uh, skip to that bit. And then thirdly, the third part, we'll just be talking about the results from the gameplay. Okay, so let's talk about what you get in the box. So this is the box itself, enhanced LED 4K resolution, designed for the Nintendo Switch. But if you do flip it over, it does work with other consoles, works with anything pretty much, but we're gonna be focusing on the Nintendo Switch today. Uh, it has the 4K HDR logo down there. It's by Photofast 4K Gamer Pro. And then if you spin it over, it's the original, and then that's with the 4K Gamer Pro. They give you an example there, picture, and how to set it up there. In the box, you get a USB Type-C cable, you get the dongle itself, you get uh, HDMI male to female, and you get the brief instruction manual as well. And if we look at the dongle itself, so on the top here, you have a button. This is like an LED, blue LED, it shines. So you have it on off, and then you press it for one, two, and three. For the purposes of all the tests, I've left it on three, because I wanted to show it for the maximum. You have um, an HDMI mail there, that goes to your dock. And then on the other side here, we have an HDMI out, and the power. So you have to plug this into the power and the HDMI comes out there to your TV. Uh, this doesn't really fit in the dock very well. So the, this bit here, you plug that in and then you plug that into your dock. Now, what you might be worried about is it bricking your switch. Um, HDMI doesn't carry power. And um, the issue with the third party docks of uh, bricking switches are it sends power and it fries your switch. Okay, I completely get that you wouldn't want to plug this into your dock because you're worried about that and that's no problem at all. Now, once you've got your dongle plugged into your dock and your TV, what can you expect? Well, if we quickly whiz through the website and they're playing, so if I put the website up there, what we do is we'll quickly look, quickly whip through it. So here it is, 4K Gamer Pro, coming soon onto Kickstarter, instantly upgrade your Nintendo Switch to 4K. Here we have the three images of the, the upscaling, we have the low, middle, and high. For the purposes of the gameplay video later on, it is only gonna be on high, and then we have it compared to the 1080p of the regular Switch. Uh, control the look of your game with three upscaling levels. Again, as a YouTube video, go and have a look with the three levels. Uh, down here, powerful performance. The 4K Pro offers a new level of video enhancement to ensure you get the best gaming experience with a 20% increase in sharpness, coloring, and depth of field. Compared to our previous models, we achieved new level of picture quality for Switch games. Again, you can be the judge of that when you go and have a look at uh, the gameplay video later on. Generally, it's just saying better depth of field, no lag dropping flame both. Um, I do have to mention that with the with the dropping great uh, uh, FPS, I've experienced no drop in FPS whatsoever using this. So then moving down then, we have the 4K Gamer Pro again, more screenshots and then enhancement tech and they say, it says at the bottom there, not just for the Switch and then how to set up. All the information is there, that's how you set it up. So when I was capturing it, um, I was expecting high hopes, so I had it splitting out into two. I had it in, I have a 4K capture card, which it was capturing at the highest possible resolution. And I also captured it at 1080p for the, for the regular switch as well. And I've compared the two. Um, I must say, I never, like I said, I never experienced a drop in frame rate. However, my capture card struggled at the, at the high resolution FPS because I was capturing it for FPS. That's my fault, that was my issue. So there's not gonna be too much gameplay. So certainly Mario Kart just started to lag too badly when I was capturing it at the high quality. You you kind of get the idea. Right then, that's enough of me talking. What you want to do is you want to get into some gameplay so you can have a look at it and then we'll come back to the tech test so we'll, we'll quickly talk about what we've seen. So this is it then. You're going, it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, we're splitting up the 1080p and the 4K footage. Sit back, enjoy, have a good look, stick this up to the highest resolution you can and have a look at this gameplay. Thank you. 
Okay, that was it then, that was the gameplay. What do you think? If you haven't already, which I'm sure most of you have commented already, what do you think of that footage? Um, there is a difference, isn't there? It's certainly a difference. I'm no digital foundry. I haven't got thousands of pounds worth of kit to work out whether that's actual 4K or not. It's probably up, upscaled. But what I can say is I really enjoyed using this. Am I gonna keep using this and plug it into my Switch? Absolutely I am. It does improve the picture quality for me, but I didn't have it on number three. So the highest one that was all that gameplay, I didn't have it on that. I had it on one or two. I think two was probably the, the one I have, I've had it on the most to give it a little bit of a boost, a little bit more color, a little bit more sharp because I think that just increases the sharpness and the colour. So yeah, I'll be using this. Why not? It's just a little bit of fun to have stick in your Switch. And if you want to go and have a look, they'll leave links down below where you can go and have a look at the Kickstarter campaign for it. They've got some money off and some deals. Go and have a look at it. Okay, if you've got any questions, do let me know. Um, then please do like, subscribe. Until the next video. Bye-bye.